this video tutorial i will explain what is replication in kafka and what is replication factor in kafka kafka is fault tolerant which means ability of the system to continue operating without interruption when one or more components fail each partition is replicated across multiple servers for fault tolerance we will see the example so that you will understand only one partition will be active at a time and that partition is called leader and other partition will only replicate messages and those partitions are called followers the leader handle all read and write requests for the partition while followers passively replicate the leader here we can see the example of three brokers one topic one partition and one replication here you can see the kafka cluster and it has three brokers broker 1 which is running in the system and it is in india broker 2 which is running in the system which is in usa broker 3 which is running in the system which is in uk and it has one topic and same topic is replicated in broker 2 and broker 3 and it has one partition here you can see partition 0 it has only one replication so the partition will be available in broker 1 only and it act as a leader there is no follower because it has only one replication here you can see the scenario 2 where three brokers one topic one partition and replication factor is 2 since replication factor is 2 the partition 0 will be available in another broker in this case partition 0 is available in broker 2 and in broker 1 partition 0 is available that is called leader and in broker 2 partition 0 is available that is called follower all the read and write operation will happen in partition 0 of broker 1 and all the data which is available in partition 0 will be passively replicated to broker 2 partition 0 which is follower here you can see the scenario 3 where three brokers one topic one partition and replication factor is 3 since replication factor is 3 the partition 0 will be available in broker 1 broker 2 and broker 3 and partition 0 of broker 1 is called leader and partition 0 of broker 3 and broker 2 is called followers all the read and write operation will happen on leader partition which is partition 0 of broker 1 and follower partitions which is partition 0 of broker 2 and partition 0 of broker 3 will replicate all the messages from leader partition which is partition 0 of broker 1 now we will see what is the advantage of uh, this kafka cluster and uh, why do we need that suppose say we have a producer which uh, generate the messages and uh, publish the messages and uh, all the messages will be published to leader partition which is uh, partition 0 of broker 1 and uh, whatever messages are available in uh, partition 0 of broker 1 will be replicated to partition 0 of uh, broker 2 and partition 0 of broker 3 those are followers suppose say this broker 1 is crashed even though broker 1 is crashed all the messages are available in partition 0 of broker 2 and partition 0 of broker 3 which are followers so what apache zookeeper will do is it will elect one of the follower partition as a leader suppose say broker 2 partition 0 is uh, elected as a leader then uh, what consumer will do is it will consume all the messages from partition 0 of uh, broker 2 so that uh, even though the broker 1 uh, partition 0 is not available it can read messages from partition 0 of uh, broker 2 and uh, this way it supports uh, fault tolerance even though one of the broker is failed the messages are available in other brokers and the system is working as expected
you can get uh, java source code link for uh, each video from the description section of the video and uh, here you can see the video and uh, to see the description click on this uh, more and uh, here you can see the description and uh, here you can see the links and uh, click on these links to get the java source code